sing the blues for a reason, baby. When I'm writing my treatments, I often see the vision from the viewer's perspective, and then I go back and do my best to be as descriptive, pull examples, sometimes create the example, the pitch to the videographer or the production team. I'm really big on art, I'm really big on concepts. I'm not an artist that's just here to look pretty and be rich and famous. Like, my intention is to make art that is worth seeing, worth hearing, worth feeling, you know? Art that draws you in and brings awareness to important things. You know, what I've seen is the more we bring awareness to certain topics, the more society is inspired to learn more, open their minds about it, then it elevates. That's my intention in everything that I do. And my intention is in my bio too, you know, unify, heal, inspire, uplift. I had three main videos that I wanted to roll out. Foolish was one of them. I thought it was gonna be the second video. No, I just needed it to be really conceptual. Early on, I was very inspired by Beyonce's Sorry featuring Serena. I just loved the way that Serena was the main subject. Beyonce was kind of like appearing throughout the house in different places. Initially, I saw myself and a really good friend of mine doing that. And then it kind of grew to this idea of like of the camera panning like a friend come in the scene and have the camera on her the camera follow her being the main subject and have it pan back and then have me appear there I gave this kind of like majestic ghostly witchy vibe to it so basically let me get to the point Marcus and I we talked briefly and we were kind of just like spitballing ideas back and forth we came to this idea of like he being a cameo that's what it was we had the video really be focused in text dancing as he moved through the space. We were going for just like a simple, streamlined, yet conceptual approach. Marcus, he like snapped into the most amazing, multifaceted, like hybrid director slash videographer I've ever seen. And he was just able to create in that very moment the idea of me symbolizing an unseen touch for text. After the shoot, I came to realize that the concept grew to me symbolizing the dark truths, you know, and Tex experiencing those dark truths and feeling them, but not being able to see them, which connects us back to turning a blind eye next back to being foolish or ignorant or not seeing the red flags, the issues. Voluntarily? Hmm, I don't know. Let's discuss. I see, and today you suckers are getting made. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta watch out, make sure that you.